this video, we'll go over the new Park and Resume email feature. Genesis Cloud allows you to park an email interaction and then resume or unpark the interaction later. A key benefit of using this option is that it enables agents to pause and resume the email later without losing context. When the agent clicks the Park button, the email disappears from the Conversations list and goes to the list view. Once it's parked and in the list view, it no longer counts toward the agent's handle time. To resume or unpark an email interaction, agents should navigate to the sidebar and click on the list view. Here, agents will see the search option, the sender's email address, the time the email was received, subject, Park duration, expiration time, queue, and the icon to resume work. When agents click the resume work icon, the email interaction returns to the interaction section in their conversation roster. If you park an email interaction for more than seven days, Genesis removes the interaction from the park conversations and returns it to your active interaction roster. If a customer sends an additional message, to a parked interaction, it is removed from the park conversation list and returned to your active interaction roster. Supervisors can find parked interactions in performance workspace interactions. To make it easier to find parked interactions, add the active park column by clicking add column, searching for active park, and then clicking save. When supervisors click on the three dots, the Assign to Other option appears. This allows them to assign the part email interaction to a person or a queue. Simply start typing the name of the person or queue and select. Once the email is reassigned or transferred, it is no longer in the part state. Thank you for watching.